guys, Tom Dodge here and welcome back to my channel and this is a video that I've been trying to film for absolutely ages. I was up here doing a makeup look which you guys will probably have already seen, which is currently on my face, but I thought I would finally get around to showing you this freaking huge collection of clothes that I have been gathering over the last few weeks. Um, I decided that I wanted to change my style only very slightly because um, I've always liked alternative, you, you guys have seen uh, the way I dress in my videos, this is just like a norm. This is what I would wear out on the school run or something like that in the summer. But I decided I wanted to change it slightly, change it just a little bit. I wanted to go a little bit more down the alternative, like rockabilly, pin-up sort of way. Like I fell in love the way with the way my daughter dresses and the way she does her hair. So I kind of wanted to want to dive down that road and see if that works for me for a bit. I may just end up going back uh, to the way I used to dress before, which is a lot of jeans and things like that. But I wanted to try something different so I have a huge ginormous pile of clothes down here that I'm going to share with you guys so I'm just going to stop rambling and get into it and just show you what I will probably do is if I have prices for these because a lot of these things I'm not one for like going and spending a whole ton on clothes when you can get some absolute bargains on Depop and eBay so I have so many clothes down here I will say where they're from and I will put like the price on the screen somewhere just so you guys get an idea of where I got them from so I'm just going to show you these first these are two belts and you will see them because I'm going to put footage when I show certain outfits off not gonna lie not the most confident when it comes to my body uh but that's just old issues um but I'm, I, I tried the clothes on for you guys and i put like i'll put footage up here as i'm sort of talking as we go so um first is these like i think they're called nurse are they called nurses belts i think that's what they were like they look like this let me just do them off and these go around your waist if you've got like a circle skirt on and a cardigan or something like that these go around your waist around the top of the circle skirt and they just look really really flattering so i got a couple of those they were like 2.99 or 3.99 on ebay so i got one in red and one in black because black is a staple in my wardrobe regardless i've always been a sucker for black i love black um so yeah there's those two and you will see those in some footage as you see me trying on the clothes the first thing I've got here is just a literally, if you're going to do like sort of a rockabilly style, um, like the three quarter length sort of trousers or turn ups, these ones are like three quarter length. So they come above your ankle, not to your knee, but like sort of in between. And they have the turn up on there. Um, and they look really, really nice in the summer and with some like converse -y sort of style shoes. Oh, which I will have to get because I have two pairs of shoes to show you guys as well. So I'll have to run down in a bit, but I need to get through this. So these look really cute with certain tops, um, which you will see. In fact, I'll put some footage up now of me in these with a certain top that you will see in a minute. So yeah, that's those. They're the first thing I picked up and they were on eBay, if I remember correctly. So I'm gonna pop that there. The next thing I got is just a plain vest. This was a couple of pounds from Depop. Um, I thought it might look cute underneath skirts or something like that. Uh, and it has little anchors and polka dots on it. It was literally like two or three pounds. So I just thought it'd be really cute. And maybe you could put it a cardigan over the top to sort of style it up a little bit if you wanted to. I am in no way, <laughs> any way, shape or form good at putting outfits together when you see me in the outfits up here i just i just i'm not very good at styling clothes i just i'm just not so just be aware of that when you're looking at me in the clothes in the corner i don't know which side i want to put it off when i keep pointing over here so we'll probably go over here so the next thing i got this is um i think it's hell bunny i have two of these you will have already seen one of them where is it is it hell bunny i want to give you the right pretty sure it's hell bunny it's hell bunny so this is a hell bunny um these are like sort of gypsy sort of style tops and they do look good tucked in i'm not i need to get more confident with tucking clothes in because i'm like so not confident when it comes to tucking my clothes into my trousers or skirts or things like that i'm not like the most comfortable with my body um i would say so clothing what size wise i'm probably like a 14 but I'm really quite curvy for a 14. I have huge hips and a huge ass. It's not even fun, especially when you're trying on certain clothes. I sometimes don't feel like I look really flattering in jeans and things, but then certain dresses I feel quite comfortable in. So yeah, this is the first one. This is like a cute little apple sort of gypsy style top. So that's that one. And then, 
I may as well show you the other one while I'm here. So I will lean down quite a bit, I do apologise. This one is like the lemon version. So I think this one's slightly bigger as well. This one feels more flattering on. The other one's quite tight, so it would probably be more comfortable if I tucked that into something. But this one looked really nice undone, which you will have seen, I think, in the pair of like three quarter length jeans with this over the top. So that's that can't remember how much they were they were a depot bargain but i will list it somewhere i'm just gonna have to grab some of these are on coat hangers so uh, yeah so this i absolutely fell in love with like the hell bunny cardigans and the band cardigans if you haven't heard of the brand band it's an alternative clothing brand um but this is one it's listed as 20 pound but i didn't pay 20 pound for it on ebay i paid i think 15 for it so it is like a cute little zombie tea party cardigan absolutely love this the, the, it's so soft and comfortable to wear and on the sleeves it has like a little bone detail on there and then uh, on the other side I think is an eyeball <laughs> so it's totally like the way I love weird clothes like if it's weird and it's like zombified or bats or spiders or something like that then I will love it more but um yeah I absolutely love that that was a more recent purchase that was one of the last things I was waiting for now I'm gonna grab for one of the skirts now I've bought a few circle skirts I've never tried circle skirts before that I can think of um but I have a few like sort of hell bunny sort of style like of the 50s sort of style tea dresses but I don't have circle skirts so I brought these um, this one I'll have to just show you the design but I will put footage of me in it up here and um, this is a gorgeous like it's like skulls with guns and wings and it's like a paisley sort of pattern hopefully you guys can see that it is huge um, my daughter's told me that I will only look like, I was talking to her today and she said because I said I, I hated the way I looked in them I, when you guys see the footage you'll understand I said I just don't feel like I look nice in them and she said you, you've got to wear a petticoat underneath it otherwise circle skirts don't look as good so there is a lot of material to these as you will see when I hold it out in the in the footage but that is what that one looks like hopefully this isn't going to be rubbish for you guys you said you wanted to see it so I thought I'd share it uh, and in that video with the skirt I wore this cardigan now this was because <laughs> I've been obsessed with trying to find these sort of hell bunny scar uh, cardigans this one's actually banned like the other one um I thought when I was bidding on this I thought it or when I made an offer on this I thought it was like um a large to an extra large which is what I tend to go for because I'm a little bit more busty at the top um but what I didn't realize is this is small to medium so you'll see me in it um and I do kind of get away with it but um yeah it's not too bad but I, I don't know but it's adorable so on this side it has like an anchor with the polka dots and the roses so cute this is going to be a long video by the way guys um, so i hope you brought snacks and drinks and then on the back it has like the skull detail with you know like a pirate skull with the um oh god the steering wheel what the heck the boat steering wheels I forgot what they're called but it has that on there hopefully you can see that in the footage uh then you guys will have already seen this cardigan. This is a Hell Bunny cardigan. Um, this one I absolutely love. This is my, this is me to a T. This sort of design is what I tend to like gravitate towards. Um, I just love it. It's just, yeah, it's the kind of style I like. So, and I love that these sort of detailing is like at the top. So you can kind of see it, especially if I'm in videos, you can see the detailing. I absolutely love this one. It's so comfy. But like I said, I'll put prices at the top. And I didn't realise it was the same design, but I actually brought a dress in this design as well. So that's what it looks like. Again, another Hell Bunny dress. It has like the Peter Pan sort of collar. I think that's the right word, Peter Pan. I think that's what it's called. Uh, some buttons, and it's just like a skater sort of style dress. You'll have, you'll see the footage at the top there, but I just love this design. And this one's like a silky, where the other one's like an embroidered. Absolutely love it. So we're on to skirts again so this skirt uh was is another hell bunny skirt if i recall correctly i will just show you there's so much material to these guys look i mean come on uh, i'll put the footage at the top of me in it 
and uh, this is what it looks like. It is like um, flash art sort of design with skulls and knives and sharks and things like that. It looks like flash art tattoos. And um, this has so much material, so it would definitely, obviously, it's got button detail at the front. It will definitely have to be worn with an underskirt because, uh, yeah. And I got this one and the blue, like, paisley one. This is hell bunny as well. These are, like, brand new. Um, I got, I can't remember what I paid for the two, but it was an absolute bargain. Um, but, yeah, I got those two. Then I picked this one. I think this one that came from Depop. This one is absolutely stunning. The detail at the bottom. I think Michelle would like this one if she hasn't got it already. Lightning Lash, you'll probably like this. Because um, I think you picked up some... You asked me about Hellbunny last year. Was it Hellbunny? I don't know. We were talking about circle skirts and, and dresses last year, I think, in, in messages. Um, and this one is like um, a pin-up sort of dressing room design. Um, let's see if I can... Yeah, you can see it. Um, you will see me in it in the footage, but it is absolutely gorgeous. This one is by, I think, Collectif. Uh, it's Dancing Days Collectif, if I remember correctly. Or is it Band? It's either Band or Collectif. Which is, the, the good thing about these is they all have pockets as well. If I've got it wrong, I will write it down below, but it's, it's either Band, the brand, or Collectif. Collectif is a really good vintage sort of, if you want like tea dresses and things, they do some really, really nice ones. Because I like the more weirder side of things and patterns, Hell Bunnies tends to be where I head down. So this is another Hell Bunny skirt. I abs this is my favourite. I absolutely love this. I didn't think I looked too bad. I'll put the footage up here. Um, I didn't think I looked too bad in this one. This one is like a, um, a zombie sort of sugar skull, sort of bride and groom sort of thing. Absolutely love this. It felt really comfortable on. Even with a cardigan tucked in, it was lovely. Um, but yeah, this is probably my favourite skirt out of all of the ones I've got. So that is that. Uh, this, this drawer is going to break. I'm literally resting clothes on a drawer sticking out. It's so going to go through the weight of the clothes. Right. This one, on this huge coat hanger, don't like this on me. Um, again, I'm not really a fan of my body shape too much because I have like really big bum and big hips so I, and I t have like quite a big stomach so I tend to sort of try and find flattering sort of tops that hide it. This is one of those tops that you tie at the front which is so rockabilly, it's so cute and it looks cute with jeans and things which you'll see in the footage there if I put it up <laughs> but um, yeah I didn't, I, I probably, I mean this is brand new, it's still got the tags um, I tried it on, I may resell it because I, I don't know, I just don't I don't feel comfortable in it so that is that but it is adorable with the little apples on it so that's that one I think we're coming towards the ends of the clothes wow I felt like I had loads now this one is another Depop buy and it's like um, a sort of stretchy sort of blouse like a polka dot bat blouse um, I think whoever I brought this off of I forget I, I reckon she ironed on these details so it looks more rockabilly because this is like Etam I feel like I've heard of that brand before, but um, the polka dots is very, very sort of 50s rockabilly sort of style. Uh, but the cherry detailing just sort of changes the, t the entire top. So it just goes to show that you can buy sort of like alternative or gothic or rockabilly sort of clothes in stores and just change them up how you want them to sort of look. So like patches, I've brought a few patches. Um, I don't think I've, I brought a little cropped yellow cardigan um, and I brought a pineapple and I'm gonna iron that on, but my iron has decided not to work. So these clothes are really creased as well. So I do apologize for that. But yeah, that is that one. And that was a Depop. I sort of brought a few things. Some people bundle clothes up for you if you buy more than one thing. So I think that came with like a couple of other bits that I've just showed you. Then we are onto this dress. Um, this again is from a brand called south this was a depop buy this is so comfy guys like so comfy it's like it's heavy and feels like really good quality but at the same time it's not like you don't get hot in it, it just it's just like really really feels like good quality and it's got like little cherries on it obviously the footage will be over here of it um but yeah that's a cute little dress for the warmer weather This dress I fell in love with so much. Um, this is a Hell Bunny dress again. It has Meow on the collar there. 
and I think has I got a little cat anywhere or am I just imagining it no it just says meow on the collar and then there's the little cat sort of detail all over it's so cute but I'll put some footage of me on the side in this so you guys can see some of these are a little bit short for my liking I'm not I don't think my legs are the nicest so but these are cute with tights on and things these are really and in the winter this one will be really nice in the winter I think with some nice thick black tights underneath so yeah I love that oh we're coming to the end coming to the end hopefully so this one was another depop buy it has like cherry dice sort of details I love like cherries and things like that. anything with a cherry or a rose or something on it I tend to sort of gravitate towards um, but yeah this is like cherry sort of dice it is your typical sort of uh, 50s sort of style tea dress um, I think whoever had this before replaced a strap on it or something because there's dice on this arm and not on this one <laughs> but I didn't realise until like when I was trying it on but there is some footage over here of me in it so you guys get to see what it looks like but it's really cute I like it this pile is getting big this one is one of my favorite dresses out of everything that I've brought I absolutely this feels so comfortable again it is hell bunny yeah I'm just a hell bunny obsessed and this is hell bunny this is going to be perfect for like the warmer weather it's so comfortably so comfortably it's so comfortable it fits so well it's got little pockets which is so unusual for like women's clothes you just don't see pockets in women's dresses and stuff and um, that is the design it's so cute i'll put the footage up there so you guys can see when i put this footage up you may it may just cover my face while you guys are looking but hey ho that is what it is but we're here to see the clothes so yeah this one i absolutely love this is one of my favorite things one of my favorite buys out of all the dresses then i picked up this one this was a depop buy again and it has like little sailors on it this one's a little bit short for me I, I the footage will be up here i felt a little bit i don't know it's a little bit short but it is really really cute that's what it looks like so cute and this pile is getting humongous and it's probably on screen then i picked up this i think this was like two pound 99 because i thought cardigans are great like if you, you you can get away with tucking them into a circle skirt but um, a bodysuit like do you remember the old bodysuits where you did them up at the poppers at the bottom well that's what this is and this was like 2 99 or 3 99 and it's like an off the shoulder sort of grey plane so it comes like this and there'll be some footage there of me in it I think in a skirt that I will be showing you in a second so yeah that was only a few pound then we have this skirt which you will have just seen i'll put the footage up again maybe if you want to see it again um this one is a collective skirt if i remember correctly yeah it's collective collective vintage um this one still has the tag on it as well i think i bought this off of, of a rockabilly alternative sort of facebook page um it's what i didn't realize when i bought it was it's actually velvet so it's quite heavy sort of black velvet material with beautiful silver sparkly stars all over it i thought it was so so cute um so but when you see the footage it looks okay but i'm not sure i don't know whether to try petticoat under that and uh see how that is but i have some shoes that i will go down and grab in a second and show you guys those because they're right so that's that hopefully you saw that in the footage oh there's so many clothes on there and i think this is the last thing i'm pretty sure um this is another band jumper cardigan cardigan so whoever this was off ebay as well whoever had this because i'm pretty sure it should undo the buttons should undo but whoever had it as has stitched it completely shut like the only button you can open is the top button which is really unusual but it is kind of, it kind of works when you've got it on so it's there's no gaping holes or anything like that from from cleavage and things uh, and it's got this gorgeous little bird detail on the arm which i love everybody knows this sort of design is like a flash art sort of look so so cute and that is the last one but what i'm going to do now is i'm going to run downstairs i have two pairs of shoes that i brought I'll be back in two seconds okay so i've run downstairs come back up i'm a bit out of breath but i have two pairs of shoes and they are both lindy, lindy bop shoes these were both ebay finds and i fell in love with them as soon as i saw both of them so this one is the first pair you will have seen them in the footage of me in the three quarter length trousers 
and it is some little cute <laughs> green polka dot taco shoes, trainers, Converse style trainers. I love them. Now the weird thing is there's some sort of imperfection there but I think it's the pattern showing through because it's the same on this one. You can kind of see the, the print from the tacos, they're so cute aren't they? I thought they were so adorable so I had to get them and they're perfect for when I've got jeans on and things because these are the sort of style shoes that I wear most of the time anyway. I'm always in sort of like a Converse style shoe. So that's the first pair. We are nearly done guys. I really hope this video hasn't been too rushed or you quite or you enjoy seeing me show you all these things. Um, but yeah, I just thought you, you guys wanted to see it. So that's my huge haul. Um, this is the second pair. It is some like brogue sort of design shoes. Hopefully my camera is focusing and it's got stars on it. Um, I didn't try these on in the, any of the videos but I have tried them on and they're really quite comfy. But they would look really cute with the star sort of circle dress, I thought, maybe. But they're so cute. Love them. I can't remember how much they were. If I do forget to, while I'm editing, to put the prices up and you want to know anything, um, just let me know in the comments and I will, you know, I'll fill you in. <laughs> but yeah, that is my huge, huge sort of rockabilly uh, alternative clothing haul. Um, I really hope you enjoyed this and it wasn't too boring for you guys because you said you wanted to see it. But um, yeah, I'm going to let you go. It's been a long day and a long night. So I'll let you go. If you're new here, subscribe. I would really appreciate that. I'm trying to get to my 2K mark and that would it would really mean the world to me. If you are here watching and you haven't subscribed, just just, just hit that little subscribe button. It helps me out. You get to know, get notified when I upload if you hit that bell as well. Because I've noticed that people that watch my videos aren't always subscribed so subscribe because that means the world so yeah i'm not going to ramble anymore if you enjoyed this video give it a th big thumbs up if you're not subscribed then subscribe and see what else there is to come because it's not usually clothing hauls this is like a new thing for me i've done a couple of clothing things on here but this is like you know i don't usually do that i usually do makeup i'm going to start talking now because i've been here way too long and you're probably bored so i'm gonna let you go hope you have a great day night morning evening whatever it is you're doing when you're watching this and i'll see you in the next one bye Thank <laughs> you.